Hello, everyone. Thank you for joining me for some rhyme time fun with Quincy the Quick Quarter Horse. Quincy is a young quarter horse who loves to run and race. In jumping competitions, Quincy always wins first place. One day, Quincy decides to go running for a while. Quincy gallops and saunters for about a mile. Quincy stops to rest by a great big tree. There is something in the distance Quincy wants to see. As he moves closer, Quincy can't believe his quarter horse eyes. Right before him is a stunning surprise. Quincy sees a massive castle with a brave knight outside. And standing beside the knights are all kinds of horses to ride. These horses are adorned with fancy saddles and colorful ribbons and bows. Quincy has never seen horses dressed quite like those. Suddenly, Quincy hears a loud trumpet blow. Everyone bows and stands in a straight row. Out of the castle comes the most beautiful princess, smiling the prettiest smile. She is the most beautiful princess Quincy has seen in quite a while. The princess wears a royal pink and purple dress. It must be one of her very best. The princess wears a big, beautiful golden crown. The sparkling colorful jewels and beads abound. Quincy bows his head and neighs when the princess comes out. There are lots of activities and festivities happening about. The princess looks up and she catches Quincy's eye. She thinks he is a very handsome little quarter horse guy. The princess beckons Quincy to come stand by her side. As she admires his beautiful coat, Quincy just beams with pride. Quincy stands quietly. He doesn't move at all. The princess pats him on his back and Quincy stands really tall. It seems the princess has a daughter whose name is Yvette. She has always wanted a quarter horse for a pet. The princess summons Yvette so she can look Quincy over. Quincy lowers his head and munches on bunches of green clover. Yvette just beams, smiles, and giggles with glee. You found a quarter horse as a pet for me? Yvette rides Quincy to the fancy horse stall. He won't mind sleeping in there at all. In the barn, Yvette gathers food for Quincy's meal. He is starting to think this castle and princess thing is a really good deal. Yvette gathers oats and barley for Quincy's lunch. She finds hay and more clover for Quincy to munch. Then Yvette takes the beautiful quilt from her princess bed. She wants Quincy to have a nice warm place for his head. Some quarter horses are just lucky, you see. Quincy is as lucky as a young quarter horse could be. Quincy was once just a horse racing in spring and now Quincy is living at the castle with the king and queen. Join me next time as we enjoy some ride time fun with Roger the Red Rooster. Roger is going to rescue Alice Alpaca who seems to have ripped her new dress and found herself in quite a fine mess. <laughs>